Number seven, letter A. Calculate the range of wavelengths for an AM radio given its frequency range is 540 to 1600 kilohertz. So we have this equation that the velocity of a wave will be equal to its frequency multiplied by its wavelength. Now the velocity here, if they don't tell it to you, we can basically assume that it is a speed of light. All right, we have to assume that these waves are traveling in a vacuum. All right, so this is going to be, so in order to find then the wavelength, simply divide out the frequency from both sides. So the wavelength here was a function of the velocity of the wave divided by its frequency. So now basically we're gonna have two types of calculations. So we plug in the speed of light up there, three times 10 to the eight, because this is electromagnetic radiation. The velocity of that uh, radiation, basically those waves in a vacuum is three times 10 to the eight. I'm using an approximated value. It's usually like three, uh, excuse me, 2.9979, blah, blah, blah. But you know, this is gonna be close enough. So divide that by now the first um, frequency that they gave you, which was 540 times 10 to the third hertz, because you need that in hertz, not kilohertz. And then you got to do a second calculation here, divided by now 1600 times 10 to the third, because we need that in hertz again. So here's going to be the two wavelengths now, right? So this is going to be three divided, by, uh, excuse me, three times 10 to the eight divided by 540 times 10 to the third. And here we get a value of about 500. 556 or so meters. And then the other one is going to be 3 times 10 to the 8 divided by now 1600 times 10 to the third. And this is now about 188 or so, right? So lambda is equal to 188, 188 meters. There you go. All right. That's letter A. Let's see what letter B is saying. Do the same, what, really, again? <laughs> okay, so, you know, just substitute these values. Instead of this one, now it's gonna be 88 times 10 to the sixth because it's megahertz, all right? And this one is then going to be um, 108 times 10 to the sixth. We'll do the first one first. This is three times 10 to the, three times 10 to the eight divided by 88 times, I did 55, whoops. Oh, now I really went and messed up. Okay, 3 times 10 to the 8 divided by 88 times 10 to the 6th. So it's about 3.41. I'm using all types of different colors now. 3.41 meters for the first one. And then for the second one, 3 times 10 to the 8 divided by 108 times 10 to the 6th. That's going to be about 2.28. No, 2.8. What? 2.7. What are you looking at? 2.78. Guys, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate it. Hopefully that helps. If you can, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.